opioid crisis in our country claims about 90 lives every day, but some local scientists are offering a glimmer of hope. News Channel 5's Tanya Rogers live for us in the newsroom with what researchers are sharing. Tanya? Well, experts say that some are addicted or misuse painkillers, but a new pill being developed at the Scripps Research Institute could help improve or even save lives. Dry ice to my condenser trap. Watch out, make sure there's going to bubble a little bit. Researchers at the Scripps Research Institute in Jupiter have a mission, how to help better the lives of people battling diseases. This time, researchers are working to reduce the side effects of opioids. Respiratory depression, where you lose consciousness and, you know, that's what killed Prince and other celebrities. Uh, potential for addiction, uh, constipation, nausea, tolerance, where you have to take more and more and more of the drug to get the same amount of pain relief. Dr. Thomas Bannister, one of the scientists working on this effort told me that he and Dr. Laura Bond worked on reducing someone's pain without the side effects for five years. They found a solution. Hopefully, even if you took 10 tablets instead of one, it wouldn't kill you. <laughs> you wouldn't experience the respiratory collapse. And we also think, uh, have some early evidence that it eliminates some of the other side effects. The next step, the pill will go through clinical trials. We found that needle in the haystack made it better and better and better and uh, we think it's, it's really exciting because it could it could uh, it could change the way pain is really treated uh, it could provide a much safer alternative uh, for physicians and, and patients who are dealing with uh, severe pain now in the world of science nothing happens overnight the people at scripps told me it might take five more years to go through the clinical trials and an approval from the food and drug administration Tanya Rogers, WPTV News Channel 5.